morning guys. We're set up with Whiskey Sloughs once again. We're in a flooded hay meadow pasture kind of thing here. A lot of sheet water around. Looks like we're kind of in a nice dry spot here where we're set up. Running knockout blinds. We got the whole crew from Final Approach here. We're filming an episode of The Last Pass. So if you guys want to, head over to the Final Approach YouTube channel, check it out. But we're going to basically just be setting up. We got about 10 dozen lesser decoys out, the Final Approach lessers. And we got the knockout blinds. And we, uh, we think this is going to be a pretty darn good goose hunt. The hide situation is not great, but I don't think it's going to matter. There were so many birds in here, it was ridiculous. But I want to let you guys know that if you guys aren't using Onyx, you really should. It is like one of the best apps that you could possibly use as a waterfowl hunter. We use it all the time navigating in the dark, whether we're driving a boat, side by side, walking in. And uh, we also use it to find landowner information to get permission to places like this so we can do some hunting. So if you guys haven't downloaded the app to your phone, make sure to do it. There's a link and a coupon code down below to save you some money. We got probably about 15 minutes or so until shooting time. Could be a possibility of some ducks showing up too. So it's kind of a smorgasbord event. We're here for the honkers, but we'll take the ducks too. So stay tuned. <laughs> Oh, here he comes. Kill its ass right there, shoot it. Down goes Tony. There she goes. Oh! Help her. Kill its ass right there, shoot it. Down goes Tony. Those were really high. Yeah, those duck levels. Well, what are you gonna do? Kill the single, kill the single. You Literally, here's the sun. Start from here. And just go straight this way to the sun because if the sun comes right through us, you're not going to get a shadow. You know what I mean? Well, we better go quick Let's if we're going to do it. We better go quick. Okay. Just have This is a prime example of what happens when you try and hunt geese with no wind. It's not going that great. We're struggling a little bit. I think if we had a better hide, it would have been a little bit easier to get them in, but it's just no wind today, and that makes a big difference when you're field hunting geese. There's a lot of geese flying around. We've had some mixes of lessers and some honkers flying around us, but nothing's Nothing's really giving it up yet, which is kind of what we're hoping for. Yeah. So hopefully, after moving the blinds here, we're not worried about our shadow as much. We should be uh, should be in decent shape here. So we'll see if it works. Oh, my God. 
Kill it. That took way too many shots. Uh, yeah, it did. I just got bonked in the head with shells. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, he's going to do the snake to you. I wanted to shoot one. <laughs> you gotta be quick. You do. Hey Tom, Good nice job. spot. Uh, yeah, I woke up in time to see him. <laughs> I was oh, yeah. Grab one more. Well, that'll do it for today. It was one of those days when the geese just humble you. The conditions were not in our favor. We had no wind. Hide was not great, but we, we scratched a few out. We got two, four, six, seven honkers and couple ducks not quite what I was hoping for but we still got some shooting done a lot more for a lot less so it is, it is what it is I don't know what else to say do you guys got any ideas we did our best yeah. we tried <laughs> we tried maybe I'll title the video we tried <laughs> we tried that would be a cool hunt if it worked out man this little flood like I don't know if you guys see it on the camera but it's just like sheet water out here and I don't know, just cool little environment to hunt geese in. So if you guys enjoyed it, let me know down in the comments. Leave me a thumbs up. If you are interested, click this video right here to keep watching some hunts. I'll catch you guys on the next one.